All right, folks. Hello, fellow YouTubians uh, and guys. So we're gonna uh, go to the extreme here. Uh, so, yep. Each one of these, I think you can see, yep, 40 pounds. 40 pounds. Each one of these, 10 pounds. 120 pounds total. So we're running a uh, number 35 uh, sprocket with a number 35 chain. Um, the pitch diameter of the sprocket is um, 2.04, uh, which means that half of that distance from this point, the center of the output shaft to the center of this chain, would be uh, 1.020, uh, round numbers, one inch. So that means if this lifts this, it will be producing uh, at least 120 pounds per inch, uh, inch pounds, which is uh, 1,920 ounce inches or 10 foot pounds. So those of you that think that, uh, you know, 10 foot pounds is not a lot, well, this, you know, will kind of demonstrate that actually 10 foot-pounds is a whole lot. <laughs> it just depends upon the gearing, how you apply it. Remember, this is, uh, and let me show you here, this is uh, the Bain's Bots uh, BB150. Uh, this is a 16 to 1 gearbox here with the uh, dual gearbox configuration uh, with the RS... Um, 775 motors wired in parallel um, so this when this is because this get this uh, gear head here has a uh, a uh, 3.25 to 1 ratio into the 16 uh, to 1 ratio which gives us a final output ratio of uh, 52 to 1 which means for every 52 turns of the motor um, this output shaft will rotate one time so uh, and effectively means that with a stall torque each one of these has a stall torque of I believe right about 120 ounce inches so if you multiply that 240 ounce inches stall times 52 that gives you your total output stall okay now that's not really usable torque uh, that's the point at which the motors give up give up the goat, so to speak. So, okay. Uh, I should note that the uh, Baines Bots gearbox, um, I spoke to the, uh, I believe the owner of the company, um, the manufacturer uh, at Baines Bots, and uh, he says these are good, to, you know, they're, they're kind of good to 85 foot pounds. Um, I believe they've tested them a bit higher, but they really don't recommend going over 85 foot-pounds. Uh, I'm only at 10 foot-pounds, so. so hopefully this all goes okay. Okay, so I got my current meter here going again, and uh, zero, and we're at 24.3, same as uh, all the other tests. So here we go. I'm going to run this slow for obvious reasons. Okay, let's see what this does. And, oops, there we go. There, okay, applying more power, more, more, more. That's six, six, nine, seven. And I'm gonna back it back down. Back up again. Three, three, five, four, four, eight, five, six, seven. So okay, and I'm gonna hit stop. Okay, so yeah, there we go. Uh, what was that, seven amps? So seven amps at pretty much 
let's just say stalls between six and seven amps. Uh, so at 120, at, at 10 foot pounds or uh, 120 uh, inch pounds, um, this basically the stall torque is, is right about six amps. So, uh, and then at seven amps, it actually starts moving. And then, of course, the faster you want it to go, the more current it is going to draw. But still, it's supplying that 100, you know, that 10 foot pounds or uh, um, 120 uh, inch pounds or 1,920 ounce inches, if I have my math correct. So, there we go, folks. And, yeah, I am uh, running this off of the uh, cheesy, cheap, you know, uh, Roboclaw here. Um, I will say it's not hot. Um, it's not hot at all. Not hot to the touch. Motors are not hot. They're not warm. Nothing is warm. I mean, this, granted, that wasn't a very, <laughs> a very long test, but uh, my... My test methods are very crude and rudimentary, uh, but yeah, so there you go, 24.10, well, 4, 3, 4 volts at, um, at about 7 amps a current or so, so the wattage can easily be worked out, I believe it's just you uh, multiply the amps by the uh, voltage, and that gives you the, uh, the watts that were being produced to produce that amount of torque, so... All right, folks, uh, I don't know exactly how scientific this stuff is. Maybe you find it interesting. Maybe it will help you in your project. Um, and, of course, my videos are not known for their uh, high quality or their brevity. <laughs> but, uh, hey, man, it's YouTube. You know, it's free. You get what you pay for. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, that's about it. Bye for now. And the monkey pushes the little icon.